Nigeria is not still that bad after all. It's still not bad though. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Have you actually wondered how many places you can actually go with this our beautiful Nigerian passport aside Cameroon, Ghana and all those simple places? Like you'll be amazed. Number of wonderful places, wonderful countries you can actually go with just this our passport. This is our Nigerian passport that most of you are seen as oh, what's there? Nigeria is this, Nigeria is that, but we still get value. So, you say we get value, pass on people. Hmm, homo, I'm going to bust your bubble in this video. Even me, when I was actually making my research, like I was surprised, I was amazed because it, as a layman, like in a layman, I felt like the only place I can travel to is just Kotonu, Bene, this one, that one, chicken. But come and see names of nice countries, better, better countries. If you enter with just this passport, you don't need your visa. And then, uh -huh. So I said, mm -mm, You see this one, this particular one. I know if you hear me alone, I got to share it with my fellow people here. So, guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your own girl, Ashi Demis. And of course, you're watching Jackpa with Ashi Demis. So, if Jackpa is still on your list, you've given up on the country and giving up or not sometimes you maybe you grew up in nigeria and everything you might just want to find a greener pasture you just want to move to a new location and aside that you can actually go to these places for your vacation for you can just go like there are so many reasons why you migrate why you relocate like it doesn't have to be kidding company i'm just trying to say that you should not give up on nigeria because if all of you run away it's gonna be paid and in, in what I'm about to say, you even know that <laughs> Nigeria only we talk bad this year. Some countries are too bad than us. Yo. Let's give God the glory. So, guys, let's dive right into it. So, if you watch it up here, please make sure you click that subscribe button so that I'll bring to you more juicy. Um, you know, you know, make sure you click the subscribe button. So, guys, today I'm talking about 70 countries. 70 countries. 70 countries. You can actually travel to with just your international passport. See, so, as long as you have your international passport, you have money for your flight tickets, and that's it. And you're breathing in oxygen, bring down carbon dioxide like you're a normal human being. You're free to travel. So, guys, let's get right into it. So, go watch it, dive right into it. Let's talk about like just small history about Nigeria. Some of the things you don't know about, and this one I'm about to say, you're really going to be shocked. Like, you'll be surprised. Like, oh, wow. So, as most of us know, like, we all know, and if you don't know, I'm about to tell you that you can actually find Nigeria is actually located in West Africa. You know, we have East Africa, North Africa west south africa and everything but nigeria is actually located in west africa and it is the seventh most populous country that is why anywhere like there's no country once you mention nigeria like this uh the other are already we actually like the seventh most populous country worldwide and nigeria is actually bounded by i know the first thing that came to your mind is ghana nigeria is not bounded by ghana oh. nigeria is bounded by niger Cameroon and Benin. Nigeria is not bounded by Ghana. Even me, I actually used to think Nigeria was bounded by Ghana because most times always Nigeria and Ghana, Nigeria and Ghana. So I used to feel like oh, Ghana is there now. Uh -uh. Nigeria is actually not bounded by Ghana. So now you've met something new. Mm -hmm. So Nigeria is actually bounded by Benin, Cameroon, Chad, and Niger. Niger, sorry. So those four countries are where Nigeria is bounded by and not supposedly believe it is bonded by Ghana. So of course you know the capital of Nigeria is Abuja. So now let's talk about how strong the passport is. Looking at this passport, some of you, most of you have actually given up that this is just great for not it's just for means of identification card and thing. But do you know our passport, this Nigerian passport is still stronger than so many countries passport yeah it might not be the first country passport uh, it might not be stronger than the first country and every of that but at least we know they the we are not in the last of the list we still senior some people like we still senior some people so most things so when i actually see people talking down on nigeria and everything we're not that worse <laughs> you still get so you understand you still get so so according to the guide passport index nigeria is actually 95th on the index can you imagine on the guide passport in this do you know how many countries you have in this world how many countries and nigeria is 95th she will not try she will not try 
we still try you we try we're even higher than some countries like ethiopia south sudan like, and so many other african countries like that you know some nigeria do not try i bet we still try a small small so guys now let's talk about countries you can actually go with just your international passport as long as you have money for your flight ticket you are just you are a normal human being and then you find yourself in the nice flight to these countries where you can go for your vacation you can go for um normal um the location you can start with your japa journey and everything so now let's talk about countries you can actually go with just your international passports so i will actually be grouping them into three categories the first one is visa on arrival countries the second one is visa free countries and the third one is e visa countries so now let's start with the first one the first one is visa free countries this one you do not need any visa to go to it at all yours is just to take your passport book your flight Magada, you have wish it. so if you see me looking at my book my those countries are a lot i cannot claim it so i have to be reading it out to you guys so so for your v, uh, for visa free countries that you can actually enter with our international passport is we have barbados tell me barbados now your country barbados now your yeah, yeah, country we have Barbados, Benin Republic, we all know that one, Burkina Faso, Cameroon, Cape Verde, Chad, um, Ivory Coast, Dominican, Fiji, Gambia, Ghana, Guinea, Guinea, Bisu. So guys, you know actually making this research. That's when I heard some countries which I've never heard before. But anyways, you guys are welcome. I know that Nigerians now like to explore. I'm sure there are Nigerians there. You hear some names of some new countries. So if you know that um, your Japa, you have to take it serious, you can just type any of these new countries, just make more research about them. You can just go. So now that they never see us, they never hear so much about Nigeria, or um, Nigerians they never go there, go spy that place. You could just go there, migrate there, start life there. Gunia, Pisu, Haiti, Liberia, Mali. Micronesia, I've never heard that before. Niger, Senegal, Seychelles, hmm, Seychelles, Seychelles, Sierra Leone, Togo, Cook Island, hmm, I've never heard this one before too. Ivory Coast or Cote d'Ivoire, um, Monsterat, I'll type it when I'm editing. Monsterat, New, Saint Kitts. Um, Saint Kitts and Nevis, Vanna. I've heard of these ones before. Are we in this world together? Okay. So, um, the second one is um, visa on arrival. This one, when you just take your passport, you book your ticket. When you get to where you're going, these destination countries, that is when they will actually give you visa. So you actually need visa for these countries, but you don't apply for the visa from Nigeria. It is when you actually get to your destination. At the airport, just take your passport and just stamp the visa. And then the visa um, stamp your visa, and of course, it's actually a chart. Um, a chart. Some might be fifty dollars, some might be thirty dollars, twenty five dollars, depending on which one. So, list of those countries we have: Cosmos, Ethiopia, Lebanon, Maldives, 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 Mauritania. Mauritius, the bunch of Momo, Palau, Rwanda, Uganda, Vanuatu, it's as if I'm reading Russian language, Bolivia, Cambodia, Iran, Mozambique, Namibia, Samia, Somalia, Timor. Let's stay. Hey God. To value. Please, if you are watching from your country, no vessel, no vessel at the time. It's, it's, it's not, I, I, I've, I've never heard these countries before. So, now that's all for um the countries you can actually get visa on arrival. Then the next country, the next session is the one you can actually apply online for the visa. You don't have to do all this visa wahala, go to the embassy, carry booking a date and everything. Just go to their website. You know how to do the normal online application. So this is a country we have Albania, 
how Antigua, Antigua and Barbuda, I think I've read that one before, it's a Bible. Antigua and Barbuda, Baham, Baham, yeah. Colombia, Djibouti, Gabon, Christagascan, guys, I'm, I'm so bad in pronunciation, I'm so sorry. Lesotho, Malawi, Moldova, Norfolk, Iceland, Pakistan, Qatar, Sao Tom and Principe, Singapore, South Sudan, Saint Helena, Sumani, Turkey, Dubai, Uzbekistan, Zambia, Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe and Zambia. I don't know. What are you guys feeling like? Are you not supposed to be friends? Aren't we supposed to be friends? Naples and... Aren't we supposed to? It's fine. So guys, that will be all for all those categories. Please! 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 I want to say something. Before now, these countries, they were actually more than this. They were up to 100 and something. But with time, with our people, um, I always hear me bad news about Nigeria, Nigeria, that this, they are that, and Kinecom. So, so many countries, they're actually changing their rules, bringing out different um, different um, immigration rules against Nigeria and everything. So, before you actually take your passport, make sure to visit the immigration website of any of these countries to get the latest about nigeria immigrants make sure to go to their website so it's very simple let's say you want to go to barbados you can just say barbados immigration um nigeria just type it on google it take you directly to their website read about um nigeria immigration if they change their rule if they need anything else that you have to bring along and everything so they change their rule every time you can go today visa free next week they can tell you no when you have to request for visa or maybe and some of these visa fee they might actually change maybe from visa free they might start doing um visa on arrival or they will start doing visa um online visa like e-ticket visa like so many things change there is no constant immigration rule even in nigeria we change our rules as well to the foreigners you understand everywhere even u.s this thing somebody that to apply today is even for somebody that to apply so make sure to always check their website to keep yourself up to date don't go and book ticket and now go and i get it and i say it's me that tells you verify before you go was at when i am actually making this video these countries are always are just like this but maybe before i upload this maybe they would have changed you but as as when i am making this video Look, okay, these are the list of countries you can go with just your Nigeria passport. So, guys, thanks for watching this episode. If you actually enjoy it, make sure you click the subscribe button, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and of course, I see my next video. So, guys, can you see that our passport is actually not totally useless? Now, small, small, we could declaim them. So, guys, thanks for watching today's video with me, and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching, and bye. Don't forget to click that subscribe button. What a child, you're going to tomorrow. What a child, thank you.